Now, your 41 NBC AccuWeather forecast, presented by Volume Chevrolet. Welcome back. It has been a pretty chilly day across middle Georgia. We are continuing that trend this evening with some places already below freezing here in our area. Just looking out right now in the 41 sky view from the Houston County Galleria overlooking the center park in Centerville. Still some people out there pretty late this evening, but we're going to keep the clear skies across pretty much all of middle Georgia tonight and into tomorrow. So just be ready for plenty of sunshine on the way. Now today we did start our day a little bit on the cool side. 30 degrees out there to start the day. 24 the record for cold set in 1956 and 59 is where we warmed up to. That was it for today and we're expecting a day pretty similar to that by tomorrow, although I do think we're going to start out cooler than 30 because some places across the area already at 30 here in Macon. We're sitting at 31 degrees, seeing 35 down in Savannah and 33 in Tallahassee. They are cooler than in Atlanta where they're sitting at 40 degrees. All of this cold area is going to stick around with us into tomorrow morning. You can see that we're already 17 degrees cooler than we were at this time last night. 22 degrees cooler in Columbia and seeing 21 degrees cooler in Tallahassee. So we are definitely feeling the impacts of that cold front maybe a day later, but it is definitely a cold one out there for tonight. Now the good news is high pressure in the area, so we're not trying to deal with any kind of precipitation, no rain, nothing like that to deal with as we head into tomorrow. It's just going to be this cold and that high pressure is going to slowly push its way further off to the east. As it does, it's going to bring us some easterly winds because it's not going to be that northerly wind that's just going to bring that cold air straight into our area. So we're going to get the easterly winds trying to push in just a little bit more moisture, still pretty dry air expected, but plenty of sunshine on the way through the day on Wednesday. Of course, at that point, we have to watch our next system because it's going to be getting its act together out to our west. You can see these showers popping up through the middle of the country. So if you're headed that way on Thursday, do know that you're going to be dealing with some rainfall, but otherwise the cold air is lagging a little bit farther behind that. What that means for us here in our area could see a few more clouds on our Thanksgiving day, but otherwise this rain is actually going to hold off until we hit early Friday morning or late Thursday night. So timing is still a question and just how much moisture there is left is also a question. But for tonight, we do know that we are not going to see any kind of rainfall. It's just going to be cold out there dropping into those low 30s and 20s by early tomorrow. If you are traveling through the next couple of days, do know that here at Atlanta, we are not going to see any kind of travel delays on our end. However, we will see some minor travel delays possible as we're heading through Thursday with that cold front pushing through and then in the northeast as we're moving into Friday. But closer to home, like we were saying, some isolated showers possible early Friday morning. That all gets out of here by the afternoon and we're looking at a dry weekend. Should be pretty nice with mostly sunny skies out there generally through the rest of the week weekend, but as we're heading into next week, we will see another small cool down moving in. So we're moving through the rest of next week. In just 10 seconds, I'll have a look at our seven day forecast. At Volume Chevrolet, get oil changes for life, plus a 20 year, 200,000 mile warranty. Visit Volume Chevrolet, I-75 exit 187 in Forsyth. That's volumechevrolet.com. And here's your 41 NBC AccuWeather 7-day forecast sponsored by Volume Chevrolet. Temperatures hanging out in the upper 50s for tomorrow. Sunshine on the way once again. It will be cold leading into Thanksgiving Day, but we get that little bit of a warm up for Thursday with highs getting back into the middle 60s. Only a real chance of rain for the next seven days comes early Friday morning. For weather updates on the go, download the 41 NBC AccuWeather app and follow 41 NBC on Facebook and Twitter.